In our last video of the pediatric series, we will provide an overview of temporomandibular joint injections. The TMJ is a hinge and gliding joint connecting the mandible to the skull. The most common indication for pediatric TMJ injections is JIA. However, other indications include internal derangement, osteoarthritis, degenerative joint disease, myofascial pain, and dislocation or trauma. There are no absolute contraindications to TMJ injections. The mixture injection consists of the steroid itself, a small amount of contrast, and afterwards, chasing with a small amount of contrast or saline to clean the needle hub so that the steroid does not leak out of the joint. Complications are rare. However, they include bleeding, infection, allergic reaction, dimpling or paleness, and nerve injury. While MRI is the imaging modality of choice, ultrasound guidance is the easiest and most cost-effective method if TMJ injection is indicated. Here are some of the items used during procedure. The first step is to prepare the mixture, and then prep and drape the skin, followed by ultrasound, which can highlight the temporal bone and condyle for easy needle access. The opening and closing of the TMJ further localizes the joint. Insert the needle. Then, inject the mixture. 